Hi everyone, I'm here to do a Pisces reading for all signs, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs and also cross watchers as well. Thank you everyone for watching, thank you for tuning in. So I have messages here from Spirit to deliver to you guys. So let's jump in to your reading. So we got you deserve love, you are lovable. We got true love, this is the romance of a lifetime. We got chemistry, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. And very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Right, so that's the messages. So let's get the tarot, tap into the energy surrounding your situation. So we'll do a fruit card spread. Get the current situation, obstacle and advice. So it's giving us four of wands, six of swords in reverse and page of wands. Right, so let's clarify, dig a bit deeper. We've got the ten of pentacles in reverse, hangman in reverse. We've got knight of swords in reverse. So let's further clarify, six of wands in reverse. We got the magician and nine of pentacles. Right. Yeah, so uh I could see here if you're single then uh you do have uh, someone that is in love with you. I can see yeah, there is a strong magnetic attraction here. So this reading is picking up the energy of someone that is heavily attracted to you during this time. They feel a strong chemistry towards you. And I can actually see this is someone that is really focused on you during this time in this magician energy. Um, They are using all their skills and abilities here to like manifest... Um. A, a union with you we've got the four of wands so this may be a spiritual connection for some of you possible twin flame you know with the four of wands resembling 11 11 but um this does indicate you know a stable connection, you know, a stable foundation, a loving, stable foundation that will bring happiness and joy. I really feel like this is someone that actually wants a, a stable relationship with you. They want you in their life. This person, they, uh, they actually see you as their happiness. So, uh... The thing is, uh, this person was attached to another situation, I can see. We've got Ten of Pentacles, which came out in reverse. It shows, so this indicates a breakup in either a marriage or long-term relationship here. There could have been children involved here. It came out in reverse. I feel like this is someone going through some sort of breakup, some sort of divorce or separation from someone else here. And, uh, I mean, it looks like it's a bad breakup here. We've got six of wands in reverse as well. This indicates failure, you know, someone feeling like a failure, someone not achieving their goals, someone that didn't achieve their goals. They didn't reach, uh, you know, where they wanted to be in life. Um, yes, it's a, it looks like a bad breakup. I feel like there's um, money issues, there's financial issues here. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So maybe this breakup is uh, costing this person financially. It's making them go through like a financial hard, financial financial hardships, and it's uh, slowing this person from moving on because we've got the Knight of Swords here. This is normally like the energy of, you know, swift action, and it looks like 
this situation here is slowing this person down. It's, it's kind of like putting a spanner in the works. You've got the hangman here. It's like this person feels stuck. Yeah, Six of Swords in reverse. This is someone trying to move on. Six of Swords. They're trying to move on. Move on to a place of peace and harmony. Karma waters here. But right now, they feel stuck. They feel stuck here. It's like whatever they're going through here with this other person is really like keeping them restricted, most probably. Because it's affecting this person's pockets here. This is why, you know, six of wands in reverse. This person is feeling like they're unable to achieve, you know, this new beginning here. We've got page of wands. This person wants to start something new. They want to start something new here. But they feel restricted. I really feel like this is someone... They are actually paralysed with fear at this time. They're paralysed with uh, the fear of financial hardship. That's what's keeping them stuck. The fear of this financial hardship moving forward. This is someone that um, is not really taking this... Uh, what they go through, they're not taking it well. There's a lot of fears here. Um, I feel like that's what's keeping this person paralysed right now. They're ready to move on. Hangman in reverse. I feel like they're ready to come out of this energy of being in the hangman, you know. And ready to take action. But, um, yeah, I feel like this financial situation they go through is really keeping this person in fear. They don't have much confidence here. They lack confidence. Maybe this relationship they were in was giving them the support financially. Maybe this person, may, they may have married someone for money. Or someone married them for money. But their money is being, is being affected here by this breakup. So, um, I feel like, yeah, they, they're going through, um, they're trying to uh, figure things out. You know, they're trying to uh, use their, you know, skills and abilities here to, like, manifest, you know, to manifest a new beginning. And it's like they're doing it with you in mind. This person really seems focused here on you because we've got nine of pentacles, you know. This is the energy of someone, a single and abundant, someone that's self-sufficient, works hard and, you know, reaps the rewards as well. Someone that's good on their own. So I really feel like, yeah, if you're the single one, this person's focused on you. I mean, you seem to be um, stable. You seem to have it all together. You seem to have it all together here. And uh, maybe that's what's intimidating this person, I feel. Maybe they feel a bit intimidated. They don't feel like they're enough for you. They've got enough because you seem to be all right on your own here. Eh? Whereas they're the ones that's going through hardship and instability right now. Yeah, it's an issue. It's an issue slowing this person down because right now they really feel like they could possibly miss an opportunity with you. I feel like this person wants to jump in and seize an opportunity to come in and, you know, start a new beginning with you here. Yeah. But um, because of what they're going through, yeah, there's fears that they're not able to have this new beginning, you know, have a successful beginning with you that they want. Um... Yeah, right now, that this is what's making them feel like a failure. Six of Wands in reverse. That's probably what's making them feel like they're unable to achieve their goals right now. 
But um, at the same time, with this magician energy, it, I mean, that's a powerful energy, the magician energy. So it, I feel like this person is determined. It looks like this person is determined. We got very soon. We got, we got very soon. You deserve love. You are lovable. It's like this person's determined. They're not giving up here. Yeah, true love. This person feels like you are the love of their life. So they're really focused on you here. And uh, they are determined to ch turn the situation around here. Make the possible, make the impossible possible. You know, this person wants to make things happen. So they will do whatever it takes. This is what I feel. They're not giving up. They might have been, they may be getting slowed down, but I don't feel like they're giving up here. This person seems really determined. Let me see what our spirit wants you to know. Get some further insight here. Yeah, there's a lot of chemistry here. This person is really attracted to you. There's a strong magnetic attraction. You possibly have a spiritual connection with this person, with that magician energy. We've got Snake. And Hand of Cards. Right, so, uh, yeah, competition. Enemy, clever, malicious, look over your shoulder, other woman. Right, so this is it. This is what I'm saying. It's a third party situation. I feel like this person is leaving someone. I feel like this person is leaving someone here. Like I can see, and uh, whoever they're leaving, it doesn't seem to be um, giving this person. Uh, uh, <laughs> seems to be giving this person a hard time because they're very malicious. They're very malicious. And uh, I feel like this other person, they probably know about you as well. They probably see you as competition here. See you as the enemy. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, it's not an easy transition for this person. Whoever they're trying to leave is just really just making it difficult for them. They're really malicious and spiteful. So, I mean, if you haven't heard from this person yet, then it's probably for your protection at this time. It's probably for your protection, car. That situation may be a bit messy. It looks like it's messy. Yeah. Yeah, so... Uh, <laughs> it's a lot going on. But I really feel like this is what I'm saying. This person is determined. They're still determined, though. They're still determined to be with you. They're going to show their hand of cards. They're going to take that risk. They are still going to take that risk. Take a chance here. Be strategic about it. So, yeah, I feel like this person doesn't want you to move on. You're out here single. You know, I feel like for some of you, you're a good catch. This person feels you're a good catch. You've got girl with a snake. Oh, see, once again, snake again. Empath, narcissist, paradigm, being charmed or used. Enable boundaries. We've got lightning, sudden change, shocking news, surprise, upheaval, transformation, and not enough. Frustrating in a relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear slash ego issues. Yeah, this is it. I mean, right now, yeah, this person is uh, not letting you go. For some of you, this person that wants to be with you, they, they're probably the snake themselves. <laughs> they're not letting you go. They're wrapped all around you. This person's not letting you go. Um... Yeah, it's important to have boundaries. It is important to have boundaries here with this person. Because uh, 
yeah, clearly this situation that they're, this messy situation they're involved in, do you know, is not for you. This is what I'm saying, yeah, not enough. Frustrating in relationship, lack of confidence. I feel like, yeah, this is what I'm saying. You seem, you seem to have it all together as far as this person, you know, can see. I mean, this is why they feel like a failure compared to you. This person feels like a failure right about now. You seem to have it all together. You seem to have a lot going for yourself. Whereas this person doesn't. They seem to be losing a lot. They're losing stability here. Whereas you're stable and they're not. They don't feel like they're enough. A lot of frustrations here. It is frustrating for this person because they want to be with you. But, you know, they feel like they can't be with you in the way that they want. Yeah. It is frustration. Got to, they lack confidence. Yeah, it's affecting their confidence right now. The fact that you got it going on for yourself and they don't right about now. So they're scared. You will meet somebody better than them. This is what's going on. I feel like they're the ones that's in fear. They're the ones that feel like they got competition. As I'm saying, for some of you, this person is the snake and they feel like they got competition. That you may be seeing someone else. There is fears. There is fears that you meet, you will meet somebody better because some of you are a good catch out here. I can see nine of pentacles. Yeah, there's a lot of frustrations. Oh my gosh! So it leads it leads me to lightning. It's a sudden change, shocking news, surprise, epiphany, upheaval transformation so yeah there's a lot going on right now a lot of changes there's a lot of changes and things are getting revealed here so i feel like for some of you you may hear from this person very soon shocking news it's going to be like lightning it's going to be a sudden change here this person's going to get an epiphany you're going to get a surprise but yeah, right about now, there is major changes taking place here. This person is going through a transformation. Whoever they were attached to, they're going through upheaval right now. And it's possibly messy. Yeah, it's affecting this person's pockets and everything. It's affecting their confidence moving forward. You know, it's affecting their self-esteem. <sighs> It's making them really frustrated because they feel like they're losing you and it's possible this person could lose you to someone better. There's a lot of fears. There is a lot of fears here, I can see, definitely. So, I don't know, this person may, they may get desperate. It may, it may get to that point where they're going to have to reach out. They're going to want to reach out here and say something to you, you know, to slow you down from moving on, to prevent you from moving on. You may hear from this person soon, yeah. Because we've got the page of wands here, you know, knight of knight of swords and lightning. Shocking news. And we also got very soon as well. So uh you may hear from this person soon somehow. This is what I can see here, you guys. So, I will leave this reading here. That is the messages for, for this reading. I hope it helps. I hope it resonates. Please click the like button. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you haven't already. But yeah, I do thank you all so much for watching. And until the next time, stay tuned. This situation is definitely uh, to be continued. So, I will see you all again real soon. Bye for now.